Happy New Year, everyone, and welcome back to Tragic MTG. Let's go ahead and broaden your horizons and celebrate one of the most popular formats in Magic Modern Horizons 2 set booster box. All right, let's get into this. Get me some fetch lands, get some good mythics, hopefully, a guaranteed foil and art card. Guaranteed in this whole box. Not guaranteed in every pack, certainly, right? Well, let's let's find out. A little bit of mixing of the slots there. All right, let's do this here. Uh, and of course, I will be scanning up the rares and the foils and the good stuff, and hopefully some decent uncommons. Let's see if we can get the old value out of this box. And let's see how we're doing here. Uh, is that like a walrus? A flying walrus, dude. Aeromiba. Love it. Got an island. And I already see some foils at the back there. Tireless Provisioner as an uncommon. Not many commons there. Uh, I believe I just checked this is actually pretty decent as an uncommon. Uh, Buck 88. Let me turn up the ding noise. I know everybody likes to get dinged there. And we'll throw that one on there. Got a chrysalis, a batter bone, a tap runner, and for the rares we've got blood braid marauder, chainer, and there's a profane tutor. Sorry for spoiling the very end there. Mystic redaction, the uh, sketch style, profane tutor as a foil. Uh, I believe I pulled one of these out of the last set of boxes that I bought. Retro frame, foil version, four big ones right there. All right, here we go. Just cruising right along somehow. Not really. Okay, here we go. Next pack. Uh, let's see. Yeah. So I think it is, it's guaranteed in every pack, right? Get an art card and a foil card. I should know this stuff by now. Three commons, all right. Lucid Dreams, said and done. Douthy Voidwalker. Ooh, well there's the one you want right there. That's pretty decent actually, Douthy Voidwalker. Ragavan, Nimble Pilferer. Just the standard version of it is still pretty High demand right there 83 bucks for Ragavan let's get a little red sleeve for my red monkey pirate uh, off to a good start this box right here I don't want him to get damaged as I fold it in half while I'm trying to tuck it in there all right there it is monkey pirate go greed and oh I thought that was a fetch land for a second greed has been reprinted a few times the dread maw a bridge and from the list you can get list cards out of this a seething song I don't think is a big one there we go what is this slagwoods bridge nice art glimmer baron spinner got the curator oh we got more commons in this one interesting drifter Sithis harvest hand and a cursed totem. It's a buck or so. Cursed totem. And we got a retro frame. Uh, Brainstone. It is nothing big. And a lens flare. And how to. Hey, another mini game. I'm going to check those out at some point, I think. Foraging squirrels. That one was, apparently. Sounds like fun. We got a radiant epicure. A foil retro border apparently. Acolyte. Sanctifier Envec. Shardless Agent. There we go. Cascaded up. And Terminal Agony. Under a buck for the agent. Terminal Agony and ooh, there we go. Foil retro border Titania. Protector of Argoth. Foil Mythic Retro. Let's see how that goes. Retro frame. Foil version, five bucks. All right, there it is.
Beautiful. Svilun. Got a foil forest. Baloth. Breaker. A Svilun of sea and sky. There we go. Merfolk god. Mythic. Is a couple bucks. Angelic curator. Blacksmith skill. I'm going to check the curator just in case it's really nothing. And a Dre Keeper. Nice. And a Skull Clamp. Hey, that's pretty decent from the list. There we go. All right. 1081 for the Commander version. Wow. The list, 952. So this is a big Commander card here, apparently. Uh, and I should probably put my Mythics in the Mythic pile. And my rares in the rare pile. Sure. That's not a rare. It's an uncommon. You guys know that I know what I'm doing. And you would never argue about it down below, would you? Arcus. Foundry Helix. Depot. Seem to be like an artifact uh, pack here. We got Search the Premises. Corian Ranger. Nice uh, reprint right here. Very cool art. I like that. And a ravenous squirrel. Ranger. And a squirrel. And a mental journey. Uh, I'm not sure which, if the showcase adds much value to these commons and uncommons. I don't really think so. That's uh, Gaia Drone. There we go. Progenitor Ooze and a Seal of Cleansing. And an Abundant Harvest. And a Loathsome Curator. Very nice. Alright. Come on. Where's the fetch lands? I know that they're going to show up at some point. Blossoming Calm. Ornithopter. Liquid Metal Torque was one that I think was worth a little bit on the uncommon list. Nothing super big. Territorial Kavu and another Chainer. And a Chatterstorm. Bink Bink. And Saber Ants. Let's see, Chatterstorm, pretty good common. Saber Ants, when it's dealt damage, you may put that many 1-1 one, one green insect creature tokens into play. Nah. I don't think so. What is going on here? A squirrel is meeting a snake. Captured by Legax. Barb Spike. Chitter Spitter. And a Soul Snare. And a Nested Shambler. And not much else. Okay. Alright, well we started off strong. And this middle area is being a little lackluster. Got the bridge, got a mountain. Oops, spoiling whatever that was at the end. Inevitable to trail, curse you. It's got suspend and a sterling grow, that's nice. Um, good for any enchantment deck pretty much. It's a couple bucks there. Got a floodhound and a galvanic relay foil retro border and Winchester draft is that a mini game or is that just like a different way to play I guess I should have read it and I might know more but I'm not feeling it right now uh, more squirrel nonsense right there scurry oak brainstone there's Ave again Ave Ave how do you say that soul snare and Galvanic Relay, and the Jade Avenger, and a Squirrel Token. Next. Ragavan's carrying this whole box so far. Got Suspend. We need some of the Evoke Elementals to turn this around. They're pretty decent. We got a Cauldre Complete. Legendary Artifact, Living Weapon, Indestructible. Ooh, there we go. Retro Marsh Flats. That's good. All right. That is not a Guru Plains. Uh, maybe it looks similar. The scanner was certainly fooled. 
<laughs> you really tried that again, huh? Let me see what the Guru Plains looks like. Not even close. It's got the nice Therese Nielsen art, but it is not that. Marsh Flats Retro Frame is 30 bucks. There we go. That one will get a sleeve when I get around to it. World Weary. And an Endling. Got a little bonus rare. And that's actually from the list from Modern Horizons 1. Interesting. It is a bulk rare. And there it shall stay. Um, and again, I don't know what I'm doing. I'll go ahead and sleeve this up right now. <laughs> yep, that's how it goes right there. All right, next pack. Mystic Redaction, of course. Trolled, yeah, Junk Winder. Chitter Spitter again. And uh, I think that's like the 15th Soul Snare that I've seen. I guess I should scan it again. Jewel Eyed Cobra and a clue. That's a nice clue token right there. Garth. Good old Garth, yep. Yeah. Parcel Mirror. The Underworld Cookbook. Fractured Sanity in a Squirrel Mob. Buck. 50 Cents. Air Amoeba. And the Shattered Ego. That's what I feel like I'm having right now. Uh, is that Dam? Yep. Damn it is. Four planes. Suspend and Zabaz. Those are not big ones. The Narcomancer. I do like the old retro borders. They're so fun. Totally lost in translation. Working together, that's not a thing. Uh, what is this? Cody? No, nope. Rise and Shine. Turn on your artifacts, apparently. Scuttle Tide. Alter the Goyf. General Ferris Rockhurik. And Braids. Not big ones there. Grizzly Fate from Judgment. Uncommon. Uh, slightly okay, uncommon from Judgment, apparently. There's a uh, foil-stamped Slagwoods bridge. Let's see what it thinks about that. The gold stamp ver version is 89 cents. Cool. So shiny. Visionary. We've got an unmarked grave and a Zurin orb. Three bucks or so there. Um, yeah, I, I don't know what my pile is doing here. Zurin Orb, um, reprint from Ice Age, I believe. Yeah, it's nothing. Sudden Edict, I guess I'll check that too. Not sure what all the uncommons are in this set that are worth anything. Hey, there's Urza, just hanging out in the locket. Hey, open up here. Kind of cold, my hands are not doing what I want them to do. What is this guy doing? Just hanging out? Late to dinner. His buddy was a little late there. Yep, graveyard stuff with elephant and hippo. Or I'm sorry, that was a rhino. I know my animals. Come on. Obsidian Charmaw. There's nothing. Hunting pack. Faithless salvaging. Uh, let's see. Not as good as faithless looting apparently. There we go. All right. Wow, we're going to need another Ragavan to save this box. There's something similar to that. Oh, that's cool. Glorious Enforcer. Strike it rich. Road Scalding Tarn. There we go. So, regular old, regular old boring Scalding Tarn. I'll take it. Sure. But being 35 and a search the premises and a Patriarch's bidding. Which is what, yeah, that's good. 
Yeah, buck ninety nine. Um, sure. Another sleeveable card right here. So I think what I meant to do here was not put slightly underwhelming rares in this pile. Yeah, now we're now we're back on track. Grief. Suspend again, and there's Dakin as a sketch card. Showcase version of Buck 99. Milliken Violent Tumor is the retro border. Nothing much big there, and a zombie. Prismatic Ending. Which is uh, apparently a good card. And I don't think I've seen one. Urza Saga. There we go. This is a pretty good card, I believe. Yeah, that's pretty good. Thirty-seven ninety-nine is good. Uh, let's see here. Get these sleeves open. Oops. Try again. There we go. Another decent rare to show off. Mind Collapse. Late to dinner. Sunscape Battle Mage, definitely the card I wanted from the list. Sword of Green and White, Hearth and Home. Shikari, Esper Sentinel, this one's pretty decent, I think. But being 20 bucks is decent, right? I could get a sleeve too. There we go. Now it's starting to look pretty decent. Young Necromancer and a Goblin Assassin. Young Necromancer as a foil. Let's check it out. Probably not much more. It's like the, literally the same. But maybe I'll use it. Goblin Assassin from Legions. Nothing big there. Whoops. Don't drop my pack here. A little stack left. Man, what's going on there? Piercing Rays, ouch. This is a red pack. Zabaz, on Mark Gray, we've already seen these. Bing, that was, I guess, a dollar or something. Ornithopter of Paradise, and the Reaver. Okay. We get another Mythic here. Close things out. Got a Thrasta. That is Thrasto. Recalibrate. Marsh Flats, all right. Another Fetchy. And another Braids. I don't feel like I wanted another Braids. Modern Horizons 2. Regular Marsh Flats is 19. Open it up and sleeve it up. Doing good on the rares here. Braids. That's it. We got Mitra's Manufactory. I gotta do something with those at some point. This is uh, Chatter Fang, the Squirrel General. Sure. Douthy Voidwalker, Gorilla Shaman. That one was a little bit more. Drill a shaman. Nope. 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 Okay. Piru. Got Chef's Kiss. Ooh, there we go. Got Mythic Incarnation Fury here. That one should be a little bit. That's good, right there. I ran out of red sleeves, so now I just got pennies. Box is turning out okay here. We got a hunting pack, Fetty Titan, and a prismatic ending with the foil retro border. So this might be a little bit. 
the foil looks really nice on the retro border there. So I wonder if it must not be the etched. I'm going to have to type it in. Looks good. Prismatic, prismatic ending, retro frame, and it is the foil version of that, so that makes it 10 bucks, right? Definitely immediately needs a sleeve, because that foil kind of looks delicate. Yeah, that is not the etched. It looks really nice. They should probably just discontinue the etched, honestly. I don't think anybody likes it. That is a good one. All right. I haven't seen anything borderless yet, have I? No. No? Do they get borderless or you just get retro? There's some borderless stuff here. Uh, let's see, you got a full island. Restoration, Necromancer, Sanctifier, Envec. Another agent. And a ravenous squirrel. And a regular squirrel. Just a few packs left here. We got Gaia Drone. Ripley. <laughs> Should I try it? Asmora and now more to catalyst fragilistic espialidosis. You guys know how that always goes. 88 cents. Chance encounter. And a Chrome Courier and a Wayfarer's Bobble from the list. See, I guess that's the kind of card you'd want to have reprinted over and over and over. The list, 269. We'll pull it there. This is the Squirrel Sanctuary. Dromedary Nettle Cyst. Here's a buck. The Drake. We got late to dinner. Uh, sketch version. Arcbound prototype. And this is the last pack. One more mythic. Come on, let's do it. We've got. What is happening here? Look, oh, yeah, captured by Legax. Throws me off because the art is like blown up where you can actually see it. And a black pack. Timeless Witness. Um, I think it's an okay card. It's. You know why? It's one more mana than the Eternal Witness, so it doesn't help it much. Sylvan Anthem and a Search the Premises sketch. So there's a buck, Search the Premises, and a Mithras Factory. That's the showcase right here, right there. Anything else? Your Amoeba, Charger, and actually got a rare from the list, a Your Tiller Nephilim from Guild Pact is... 39 cents. All right, that is going to do it for 2021 and this box of Modern Horizons 2. And uh, I think I did okay. I'm happy with it. So thanks for watching, as always, uh, and I'll catch you next year.